Hey everybody, Doug here with a Pennsylvania Dutch Word of the Week, and this week I bring you one that has probably often crossed over into some English speakers' vocabulary in Pennsylvania Dutch country, and that is the word gritlich. Gritlich is an adjective used to describe somebody who is cross, crabby, uh, how else could we translate it? I wrote another word down. What did I write? Testy. Eh, crabby is the one that I usually think of when I think of someone that's gritly. Now you, maybe, like I said, maybe you heard your grandmother or grandfather talk about somebody, oh, he's so gritly or she's so gritly. It's such a great word because it has that sound. It's one of those words that sounds like kind of what it means. Someone that's cross, crabby, testy, ugh, they're gritly. It's a great word. Start using it. It's easy to say, grit. Lich. Grit Lich. <laughs> I love it. Uh, so there's a new Pennsylvania Dutch word for you, or if it's one that you heard before, now I'm reminding you of it, and you can go forth and use it. Next time you run into somebody that's cross, crabby, or testy, you look at them right in the eye and say, why must you be so gritly? Life's too short to be gritly. <laughs> Till next time, keep practicing your Pennsylvania Dutch, and mox good.